Good day everybody, World Money Wins here. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm trying a new app out on my phone for video. Um, the, I have a Sony Xperia and it, it comes with an actual Video Pro um, application pre-built into the phone, which I never p paid attention to. So I'm not a photographer or videographer, but uh, I've been making videos, so I might as well give it a try. Let's see how well it works. Looks like it seems to be working pretty well. I have to do something about the lighting though. I'm gonna have to get a uh, some soft boxes because you can see up there, you can see the fluorescent light in the ceiling, the LED panel. So I'm gonna get some lighting where I can turn that LED, turn off the uh, office lights and then actually have lights just for making videos so i broke out a few vintage pieces to show off that I, these are the recent pickups i've I, I grabbed um over the last few months and it appears that the gold and silver are back up above let's see silver is above 23 again at 23 dollars and 22 cents and then Gold's up nine dollars and sixty cents to nineteen dollars, nineteen hundred and fifty-three dollars. I wish it was nineteen bucks. So we've had a pretty severe price drop. So it's a sale, in my opinion. I'm I'm constantly buying anyway, so I don't. I usually don't pay too much attention to spot because if the spot price goes up, I still am going to purchase metals because this is to me this is money and I know it's it always goes up and down but I just am bad at timing things so I just buy constantly and it uh, it ends up working out I, I purchased a lot of silver at at about six dollars an ounce to eight dollars an ounce so you never know where it's gonna go so who knows, maybe when it gets up to 50 bucks, maybe I'll slow down or 30 bucks. I don't know. But who knows, maybe we'll look back on $50 silver and go, wow, I wish I would have just backed up the truck when it was 50 bucks because now it's extremely high. These things are, I've been really getting into the vintage silver again lately since I had put out a video a couple months ago about one of the mistakes I made was I sold some silver and I sold some silver that was vintage and I did it because it wasn't pretty wasn't cool looking it was you know dinged up it's got imperfections and when I sold it vintage silver wasn't really a thing nobody really cared much about it but now I can see it was a mistake this thing's got some beautiful toning to it Let's see if we can get it on camera. That's pretty good. You can see the rainbow effect around the edge. It's weird how this one's toned up and this one's not toned at all. Not a bit. And they're all kind of in the same batch here. Here's one that's kind of got an overall uh, bronzing tone to it. Oh yeah, the, the uh, I got an email from Stock Pulse about the Silver Symposium. Um, they were able to get a larger space at C and more rooms at Caesar's Palace. So uh, I would recommend if you haven't bought your tickets, um, you might want to get them. I'll put a link down below for the tickets. But it's a it's a really cool event. It's like a who's who in the uh, in the silver space. There's tons of YouTubers there, popular popular YouTubers. Um, Economic Ninja and Financial Prepper and Rob Keens from Gold Silver Pros. Um, Mark Yaxley was there last year. I think he's going again this year. Um, if you don't know Mark Yaxley, you might want to type him up in the search bar. He does interviews. He owns a, a vaulting company. Um, but his uh, interviews are really good. He really explains things super well. Um, and the cool thing about the Silver Symposium also is all the YouTubers and the, the executives and stuff there aren't just ushered off into some green room 
in a private area, they're they're actually mingling about. Um, and you can see in the pictures, actually, um, if you go to the link, there'll be some pictures um, showing just people milling about and talking. And there's really cool speakers, lots of mining execs. And uh, actually, with the purchase of your ticket, I think it's $89 for a ticket. And with that $89, that includes an ounce of silver. So you will leave with silver. Um, most likely, you'll leave with more than an ounce of silver because there's booths sometimes that will give away like fractional silver. Um, if you look at my YouTube videos, I've got two two videos that have uh, hauls that I got um, from the silver symposium. So I, I leave with several ounces of silver that I didn't pay for. Just They just give it out. Um, there's like a, they they usually have a booth crawl where you if you go to they'll give you this bingo card um, and it's got all these it's got like ten oh five ten like twenty booths on it and then if you visit when you visit the booth they'll stamp it and the, when you fill up the card or at least the, last year when you fill up the card you got like five ounces of silver and it doesn't take very long but it's but you you visit the booths and you talk to like the like uh, First Majestic, you go to the First Majestic booth. Last year they had some silver there that they sold. It was really close to spot price. I bought a five ounce, five ounce bar from them that was like impossible to get online. They were out of stock of five ounce bars everywhere except for at the Silver Symposium at that time. But I think that's about it. We got, we got a bump up in the price in silver today. I showed off some vintage silver here. I really like this one. I've been collecting the, the bank themed silver um, bars now just because I, who knows, maybe banks will go away with the introduction of CBDCs and all that stuff. Maybe we won't have banks anymore. So I just, I think it's kind of cool just getting bank themed bars. So I, I'd like to go over to Canada, which isn't too far from me. And, get some TD bars or Scotiabank bars. Um, so I'll have to visit some coin shops over there. But anyway, that's about it for today. I hope you guys are having an awesome week. Uh, it's Friday, so I'm sure I'll be having a little bit of uh, fancy whiskey this evening when I get home. But I hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you in the next video.